Yankin Talents was working and Mr. Lindsay started bringing the artists them now. And then Papa Sun and them you they know, you know, come up and pass through the downbeat and, and not son, Papa Sun telling me that they never know they must have great DJ till them pass through downbeat sound. Because every DJ that DJ pan downbeat sound, I test them. Mm -hmm. I give them some reading what they're not used to. You know, because with Shining and Santa, mm -hmm. we don't do the rehearsal with them. Because I said, if we don't pick up DJ, I don't want to program myself with them. Yeah. Some people say the best to program, but when you program yourself, they do the same thing every day. Mm -hmm. So if they want to practice, they want it and come. When they, when they come and play and DJ and pan down beat song, I just play part one or part two and part three. Give them the name of the artist. I said, part two or part three. Hmm. I said, don't call. If you hear the rhythm, don't call the artist name until I tell you. Hmm. Because you might hear the rhythm and it's not the same artist where you think. Yeah. But Captain D, Captain D, one of those guys, they was like a warrior. And don't be so. Them don't afraid of nobody, man. Mm -hmm. Computer and how we them. Them yeah. don't afraid of nobody. Them tackle any artist that come from Jamaica and defend it. Mm -hmm. I remember one night we ever dance with Stero One. I know at that time Stero One was the body sound. Yes, man. Coming from Jamaica. Mm -hmm. Lieutenant Stitchy, Wolfman, Ricky Stero then. Mm -hmm. And Sitchi and Santa was going for it. But me like, you know, I like certain thing, you know? Mm -hmm. And so, and Devon, why me if you give him the green light? But I wouldn't give him the green light because if I give him the green light, why well, to that tougher? Mm -hmm. But you never want that because it's my dance anyway. Okay. And me and Sitchi, they get down real good as entertainment. But I never want to hear the cussing really start one. Mm -hmm. And the dance was a wicked dance in Stardust Ballroom in the Bronx. So all of them guys there, uh, Owe Banton, was a joke. Cause one night at Owe Banton, a DJ, mm -hmm. and Joseph Will, up on my soul, is my good friend, Joseph Will. And Owe Banton, a DJ, for the corner, who spared the muscle. Mm -hmm. And I tell, you know, like if I say, 196 on Valentine. And Joe's will just hold the mic, take the mic from him and say, DJ, you think you're smart, but you're not clever. Hmm. Oh, you're telling the Babylon they will you can't and they them come. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Yeah. And things like that. So we get a lot of joke, you know, mm -hmm. to the neighbors of, um, and maybe I should let out the secret to while this interview is going on. A lot of people don't remember. But I used to DJ and select my song. What? Yeah. A lot of people have been on tape and don't know it's me. No clue. That's how Don't Be Song started out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did it for 13 years. What? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And That's how did Song started out? How did you even get your name, Tony Screw? Why it's a long for that. Mm -hmm. Two brothers can call them name because I think both of them die. Mm -hmm. One night I was playing a, in a, um, a house party for a guy named Rakatoon who have a big name now, big promote, promotion name now. Mm -hmm. And we inside and I play. And everybody always know me as the, the music man because the music all call me. Dog man, you know, mm -hmm. and everything there. And I was playing a song, and this guy, they rivals the children on him, this whole art of mine. And the guy just took up the record and, and looked on it. So the team said, Where you know, you take up my record and, you know, mm -hmm. look on it. So you can't do that, man. And I said, no, just look me and look at me. I said, if you want to look at my things, ask me. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And the multitude I go on. 
some of the scores on us. Grab it out time and say, give my record, man. Hmm. And the like scuffling go on right this one, and then a few minutes after, we hear pie pie, but the pie pie will go off now. A couple of people were there, they know, think I may get hurt. Mm. What is our next man? Do a man something over a farm? Mm -hmm. So someone asked, why? The first thing I said, don't no, make it a way, you know. The eh? first thing I said, don't no, make it too, so. And it just took all the way. <laughs> one mm. one. I would have seen it in one. Same thing like the name Goldfinger. Mm -hmm. When Shine had come on the sound, a lot of people don't, don't remember since mm -hmm. me has on him Goldfinger. Yes. A lot of people don't know because mm -hmm. I have people call me. I say, well, I'm screwed. They say everything good. I say, Goldfinger, they say, you're talking right now. <laughs> yeah. People have known me for years. Mm -hmm. Because the fact about the whole thing, when Shine had come on the sound, and I asked him some question and thing, and I showed him, say, them two of them, I caught a goal. I'm going to play an idiot song. And the two of me plays goal. And I'm just going on the dance with Kai and Brigitte really try to say, Diamond Finger, it never work. Mm. You know what I mean? The gold finger does steady and steady and work. And we even have song about it, Johnny Asburn, Chuma mm -hmm. Delgado. You know, guy, don't you know, Juna Delgado sing tune Goldfinger from the Goldfinger movie. But the word does come up, not from the movie, it just come up. Juna show, Shine it said, mm -hmm. me not play idiot tune them. And then in the tune he play must be goal. Mm -hmm. And it's something which me, me know that is true. You know, until uh, it's an issue about downbeat sound, you know. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a full time issue where you know we could do nine hours interview about it. <laughs> uh, the book, you know, the real truth about downbeat sound because we don't talk nothing when it really goes so you know, we are sure. trying to speak the truth about it. Got you. So <laughs> it's a song we really build dance all in America. And anybody I who do agree to it. Mm -hmm. And that's why I have, trust me, if you see my notes and what I know already, you'll say, okay, I'm really here to talk to you because I know you're one of the first people that did five the hard way with Briggy, Josie, Charlie Chaplin, Santa Rankin, and Shinehead. How did you come up with that there? Well, listen, I don't want to say one of the first. The mm -hmm. first. The first. I do it in America mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because um, Joe's Will came up with Sturgraf 1984, mm -hmm. first time I meet him. And you know, him and you or I have some issue. And then I you know, named Clive, a bridge in Canada. You used to have it looked like he used to have a year to year dance in Canada with Joe Charlie. I forgot the guy name, but you probably know about that too. Okay. And this guy used to have a year to year, and him and this guy named Clyde was friend. Mm -hmm. So he came over here one time, I was talking, and I meet him. And he said to Clyde, say, why don't you try to package it, Josie Charlie, and, you know, Josie Charlie, at that time it was Josie Charlie. Mm -hmm. And Clyde decides to not do it, and use my sound, and keep a couple of dances, you know. Mm -hmm. What are Bronx, what are Brooklyn, what are Queens? And first time Joseph Will DJ upon the sound. He said, Don't be it. Now you are bridging, but it's, this is not a curry fever. This sound is wicked. Hmm. From that day, you know, the man that sleep out of my house days, weeks, mm -hmm. months. Me used to book him. Anybody wouldn't say would have signed on paper, but anybody wanted Joe's Will or Brigadier and uh, they have to talk to me. And I uh, sometimes I take people money. Mm. And sometimes in a year from Josie till uh, the day before. Mm. And anything we ever do at Jamaica. I me call him and say, Well, you know, say me I try to find you. I mean, call him, he might him nah, him left it and come. Yeah. Never let me down, Richard. Are you they never let me down. 
I remember one night, then I saw him stir up right and play. Mm -hmm. And Joseph, I think him Tansel. I'm bad at him, you know. And me and him and I used to name Sir Tibbs there in Brooklyn. And Sir Tibbs bring back a brand song. He said to me, Sir Boy, I don't beat. I don't know if I'm going to come back, you know, because it's Tansel. And it's a wicked dance, you know, because the man, they have King Kong live. Mm -hmm. And they have Tiger live on the sound. Mm -hmm. We never have no every duty to give me there, keep the dance. We never have no every duty that much. Mm -hmm. I name them for say, match up with them. And at night, George said, say, boy, the man does say, boy, I don't beat a car, no say, have a sound clash and don't come. And you're on booty toast tonight now. George said, have a true name and a cover lover where I mash up the place. Mm -hmm. And Tiger have a tune in Wanga Gut. Mm -hmm. At the same time, remember them thing then. But the sound we are playing against, and it's funny, because the sound we are playing against like a part one, part two for downbeat. Because mm -hmm. the same man who give the sound, that sound is stir, stir pride, get half of the sound, and me get the next half. Okay. But for some reason, them couldn't get the sound to play the kind of man who engineer my sound and build my box them. Was the same man named Barry who build Jack Ruby box them. Mm. This podcast is brought to you by www.twolinedmusica.com.